Right, today, guys and girls, we're going to be teaching you how to make iced tea. Or I should say a take on iced tea because it's we're not in America, so we can't do the official genuine thing. However, this is a Scottish take on iced tea. Yes, yeah, so it's not like the Lipton bottles you get. And is, that, is that what you get in America? Put it in the comments. Is that what you get in America? Yeah. But we're doing our own this version. This is old-fashioned, southern-style sweet tea. Uh, first of all, uh, we're going to be making enough for probably about 1.5 litres, I would say. So, first of all, what you're going to need is uh, five tea bags, and I've used the Scottish blend tea bags. Uh, they give a mild flavour, just a very original tea. Yeah, kind smooth of kind of. Yeah. yeah. I was wondering, I was asking if you used Earl Grey tea bags, would that give you a different taste? And we think that probably would. Yeah, Earl Grey has that bergamot and is dried slightly differently, so it would give you a more herby taste to it. But you can really add to this recipe. But yeah. This is very basic. So yeah, first of all, what you want to do is get a jug, uh, probably about 750, probably a litre jug, and you want to put the tea bags into it. Now I've already boiled some water, and here into it, you want to put about two cups, two cups of water in there, and then you leave that to brew for about 10, 15 minutes. Now whatever you do, do not stir it, and just let the tea bags brew on their own with the hot water. Okay, next stage folks, after about 10-15 minutes time, you want to get the jug and just pour straight into another jug through a strainer. Just pour all the tea in there. I oh, need more than that. <laughs> now this is just phase one. So this, phase one. this isn't the initial... This well, is like concentrate iced tea. Yeah, this is concentrated. But hot. Oh yes. Yes, it's just tea. Yeah. Add a bit of milk, milk to that and you'll be fine. Now what you do not want to do is squeeze the tea bags because then you get a bitter flavour through the tea. Mm -hmm. So when you're making nice tea, you just anything that comes off is what you want to take. You don't want to squeeze it, press it, anything like that. Um, but yeah, that's it. Now we're just gonna American viewers will be very confused at this point. Yeah. I don't normally squeeze tea bags in my time, but <laughs> no. Okay, so we're taking the tea bags out of that initial uh, first jug. Now we're going to take the tea, put it back into the first jug, and that will um, just take the concentration just mix it all up. Now to that, we're going to add one cup of sugar. Now it's a lot of sugar. It looks like a huge amount. It is one yes. big, yeah. Now this is a concentrate, so it is going to be watered down quite a bit. So really each glass of iced tea, it's about a teaspoon, teaspoon and a half sugar. Mm. So not too much. So less than your average like Coke on that, so. Yeah. So I just want to add all that into there. Doesn't look good. <laughs> and it's a lot of sugar. And you want to give that a really good stir. Now because of the tea has already been put into the water, the sugar will dissolve rather more slowly than if it's just put into water straight. So this is going to need to be left now for probably about four or five minutes. Just give that a good stir and just leave that to just really mix into the solution again. All right, so the next part, we just left this for a few minutes now, and this, hopefully the sugars will have dissolved into the solution. So I'm just gonna give that one more stir. It's really annoying not being a commentator, to be honest, you know, I should be a yeah. carry on. Oh, yeah, this is my, this is my zone. <laughs> okay, now in this first picture, we've got three cups of water. I'm gonna just add, uh, iced tea, concentrate into that. And that does look like um, the lips and iced tea you buy anyway, so it's, that's a yeah. good sign. So this is this is getting ever closer to the finished product. Mm. Now. But it's still warm though. Yes, it will still be warm. Now I'm just gonna give that another stir. Then to this, we are going to add another three cups of water. So altogether we've used eight cups of water for this. Okay, so we've made the drink and it's chilled now, and we're gonna taste it. So I haven't actually tried this before. Yep. Oh, so here's right the cup. Now this is will be as strong as you want it. Hold on, right there, Jason. Now this is quite strong. This is probably as, as far strong as you'd want to go. Mm -hmm. So we're just gonna dilute it very slightly with a little bit more cold water. Okay. And I'll pull. 
pour myself a glass because I just do love iced tea. It does actually look pretty nice. Um, it's not, you can tell it's got water in it. It's not like thick brown black liquid. It's got dilution. Oh, so, yeah. yeah. Cheers. That's good. Yeah, it's nice. That's really good. Because it's, you've got that element of tea, but it's in a completely different zone, you Sweet know. cool. Yeah. I really like it. Because I normally have hot and no sugar. So. That's mm. good. So, well, thank you for watching our video. Yeah. Do you have anything else to say? Well, I hope you enjoy it if you do try this recipe. Mm -hmm. um, feel free to adapt it in any way you like. Mm -hmm. By all means, try different types of tea bag or whatever. If you're feeling pretty snazzy, you can uh, make a video and put it as a video response. I'll watch it. I'll comment on it. Yeah, if you have any um, different, I don't know, but especially if you're Americans, you've probably grown up with that iced tea. So if you do have any things which you think could make it better or different taste or put a little twist on it, mm -hmm. just uh, shoot us a message and we'll get to it. Yeah, so yeah. see ya.